Hello and welcome to this module on in an introduction to bio-risk management. Today we will be demonstrating to you on the usage of the pepper. This is a powered air purified respirator which is designated as a PAPR. The PAPR consists of a helmet which is mounted with a filter which will, which will filter out most pathogens. It also has a shroud and it is a self-contained unit. Now the way in which this functions is that the air is pulled in from this side, it passes through this filter and a fan will create a downdraft on your face. Now these respirators need to be powered by a battery pack. So I will demonstrate the usage of this to you. Wearing a belt, this is the belt. You need to adjust this belt because once it's inside your Tyvek suit, you will no longer have access to this module or this belt module. The second one is you need to know about is this battery. This is a battery, so please ensure that your battery is recharged prior to each laboratory experiment. Okay, I'm going to fit this on my bed. Now, if you notice, the Maxair has a shroud. Okay. This shroud can be recycled by, by uh, basically we decontaminate this, but it's also recommended in case of a spill, you need to replace this with another shroud. This is the wire. And if you look inside, you will see an adjustment for the headband. Okay. So once you have worn your Tyvek suit, you have to wear this like this. Okay. So please ensure that you have fitted your power, or else you will suffocate. I'm going to turn on the power. Okay. Now the power is on. And when the power is on, you will see three lights here, which is indicating power off. So this battery will last for around six hours, after which you will have to recharge this battery. Okay, so I'm going to wear this now. Okay, I've mounted this. You can see how it's worn. So that's how it looks. And then, and then you're done. So this is the basic setup for the shroud. Then you want to take it off, move it this way. And you keep on keep it running until it's off and then you disconnect the battery. Okay, generally after every biosafety procedure, this helmet will be decontaminated using a surface decon and in some cases we will change the shroud. And after completion of your procedure, please ensure that your battery is charged. Okay, that's a brief introduction to the Max Air system which we use. It's a powered air purified respirator. Thank you very much for watching.